If you want to learn how to blur the background in CapCut, just like this, then this video will show you how step by step. Okay, so let's use this video as an example. We bring it down to the timeline. So how do we blur the background? Step number one, make sure you click on the video, then click on effects over here. And then on the left side, you want to look for lens. Click on lens. And then if you scroll down, you want to look for blur. Okay, so this is the blur effect. Click and hold, and then you bring it down to your video. And then you let go. And now we can see that this video has the blur effect. And if you look over here on the right side, you can adjust how much blur you want. So the default is 50. And if you want to make it more blurry, you can just drag it to the right, all the way up to 100. And you can see it's very blurry. And of course you can lower the blurriness to as low as you want. For now, let's just leave it at 50. All right, so at this point, you can see the entire video is blurred. So step two, click on media, then click and hold, then bring the original video down again to the timeline. Now make sure you put it directly on top, okay? If it's like that or like that, then make sure you adjust it and put the original video on top. And now at this point, we can move on to step number three, which is the final step. Now you click on the original video, the one on top, then you go to the right side, you see video, you see basic, you see cut out. Click on cut out. And if you look below, there is this thing that says auto cut out. Only human figures can be cut out. So if I click on this to turn it on, just wait for it to process. So let me explain it to you real quick how this actually works. So we have two videos on top of each other playing at the same time. So the video that's below, actually the entire video is blur. And then the video that we put on top, this is what it really looks like. It's just this person that is cut out. You can see that the background is removed. So this is exactly what the auto cut out feature does. It will cut out the person from the video and then it's going to remove the background. Now in this example, you can see that there's a little bit of glitch over here. What you can do is you can use the mask feature. So if you look at cut out on the right side, there is this thing that says mask. If you click on mask, and if you look below, they have a few different options. There's split, there's film strip, there's circle like this, there's rectangle like this, there's heart, there's star like this. So as you can see, mask is basically a way to cut out the video. Now, most of the time, you're just gonna use either circle or rectangle. So what we want to do with the mask feature is to just cut out the person over here so that we won't have any of this glitching on the right side. Does that make sense? So to do it, we go with rectangle like this and then we just adjust the box so that we will only see the person. So just adjust it until we have the person within your box. And then now if I play the video, we should see that there's no more glitching on the right side. That's because we already cut out this person again with the mask feature. So only this part of the video is kept. Then now we can bring this video back over here, put it on top of each other. And if I play the video, you can see that right now we have a video with a blur background. And by the way, if you want to adjust the blur, just click on special effects. If you click on it, then this thing would appear. You can see effects blur. And if you look over on the right side, you can adjust how much blurriness you want. So as promised, this is how to blur a background in CapCut.